Welcome back to another reading and correcting with me, Kindar, the Tiger Knights, and Ty, the Tiger Supervisor. These are where I read a chapter from one of my stories and correct it as I go. If you want to listen to these live, it's every Tuesday morning, 8 a.m. Eastern Time on Twitch. And if you're looking to support me, that is on my Patreon. Today we are doing chapter 20 of Breaking Step. Tips looked, er, well, looked hurriedly looked, hurriedly looked around, hurriedly looked around, around the floor, sensing for the trigger. If he'd missed one, he could have, there was nothing there. You cheated, he said, looking up. I didn't trigger anything. Yeah, I did, still replied. Tibbs, we need to talk. Kenny, are you going to let him cheat like that? This is the, this is the only way we could think of. This is the only way we could think of getting you away from Dawn, since you won't let still get rid of him. It's on my team, and that's the problem. Still interrupted. We need a sorcerer for the runs, and Turin, you assigned him on my, to my team. And you're okay with that? Still ask in disbelief. Tips filled the cracks before answering. It's what it is. Stop that! Still snapped. Just let the abyss water go and answer me. I have answered you. Tibbs? G Ganny said gently, this isn't good for you. The alternative isn't good for anyone else, and they matter more. Still sighed. You're not good. You're not doing anyone any good, Ganny said. If you can't feel anything, I can think, he replied. That's more important than feeling. And I do feel, just not as strongly, so it's fine. No, it's not. Still said, exasperated. Just let the water, just let go of the water. Channel fire and let it out. It's safe to do in here. Tibbs looked at the walls, sensed the weave. Don said it would take every element to have a chance of impacting it. Is that why you made this room? Because you think I want to let fire loose? No, Kenny replied. I designed this room so the teams facing it would have to rely on themselves instead of their elements. It's when you return the way you are. The way you weigh, the way, when you return the way you are, that's still realized, you'd be able to let it go here. Thank you. I appreciate what you're doing, but I'm fine. No, Tibbs, you're not, Kenny pleaded. You feel. That's what makes you, you. I still feel. The eyes just let me stay in. You don't stay in control, Tibbs, still snarl. You're someone who gets angry when I ate someone you, are, you hardly knew for no other reason than he was nice. You screamed at me and you made me break rules and you better than to break because your pain hurt. Tibbs swallowed and filled more cracks. I know what you're trying to do. Then stop fighting me! Tibbs chuckled. When have I, when have I ever done that? Tibbs, I'm trying to help you. I know, but I don't need the help. I'm grateful for what you do, you want to do, but I'm fine. Tibbs! Still pleaded. We did what we can, and he said, defeated. Tibbs, we'll be here when you come to your senses. Thank you, but I don't think that's... I'll make you a door that isn't guarded. Still said. Tibbs closed his mouth and stared. You can do that? I'm Stone Mountain Kravis. Stowe said solemnly, is this, all this is me, so I can talk, if I can talk with, so if I can talk with you, I can affect it. I heard you call for help all the way into town. Does that mean you can reach there? No, that was desperation. I yelled as hard as I could and hoped you'd rescue me. The siren stretch. I wish you'd let me return the favor. I'm not screaming to be rescued. Stowe sighed. You would if you weren't filled with ice. I'm fine. That isn't what people are meant to be like, Kenny said. How do you know? Tibbs asked. You admitted you know little about people, but I've seen others who did what you're doing. You did? Who? Harry, she answered. He was so filled with light that the first time he stepped where, I could, where we could see him, he blinded us. The new guard leader still said, Here, Dean. He's the same with metal. He feels like he could cut his way through my stone just by leaning against it. Tibbs... I can feel the cold radiating, radiating off you from the floor above. I'm not like them. I'm doing this to protect others. No, you aren't, And he said. You're doing it because you think it's protecting you. <clears throat> I just hope you realize it isn't. I, I just hope you realize it isn't 
before you turn into a nice version of what those two are those two are and come to us for help all right if this becomes a problem I'll come just tell me where the door Kenny sighed I just agreed with you what's the problem it already is a problem Tim you just don't want to see it she only saw what she wanted to see nothing he'd say could change that how do I explain to the others how I undid the trap think of something still snapped still I'm sorry you aren't understanding what I'm going through but he laughed Kenny said I'm sorry he feels hurt but this is my decision it's only affecting me she sighed just push on the wall to your left Tib studied the section of the wall three paces between the lines and three high like the others it was cool and solid to the touch was she trying to trick him into letting go of water to channel earth instead he pulled earth essence from his bracers and wrapped it wrapped that around his feet spreading it wide when he couldn't get it to anchor to the floor he wrapped his arm around in more of it for strength and pushed as hard as he could and nearly fell over okay yeah and okay <clears throat> he nearly fell over as he nearly fell over as the wall moved back so far too easily the only thing that let him keep his balance was the widespread of essence keeping him standing by the time he was steady again the block was back three paces and the one before the door slowly moved back revealing his team the only one looking concerned was Don I told you it'd be fine Jekyll said he halted his step in midair is it safe he pulled Tibbs Tibbs pulled the essence back into the bracer the wall section move along the grooves he indicated uh, the opening pushing this pushing this block had revealed so it is safe Jekyll asked I didn't see Tibbs touch anything for the walls closed them off Don pointed out Tibbs shrugged maybe the room's broken Stowe had told him to come up with something maybe we shouldn't risk it happening again hopefully it'll be fixed by on, on our next run he ignored the disbelief disbelieving look Don gave him as he walked by the sorcerer on his way to the exit and that concludes chapter 20 of breaking step if you are enjoying this please leave a like if you want to know when the next chapter is going to be up subscribe and hit the bell if you want uh, to read the story it is available on Royal Road for free if you want to read ahead of Royal Road and support me at the same time you can do that on my patreon where it's about 20 chapters ahead and if you want to listen to these live it's every Tuesday morning 8 a.m Eastern time on Twitch links are in the notes and with that I shall wish you a good day